Well, hello, 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 Aquarius. It's your girl, Indom. And I'm here to do your reading for the week. But this reading is going to be a little different because it's from today, Sunday, August 26th, all the way through August, Friday, 31st. Right. Um, the reason being is that um, I do not want my readings to overlap into September because I will I will be launching uh, new material in September. So uh, very quickly, I just want to apologize for not being able to do your readings uh, last week. I did have some technical issues with whoa my monthly subscriptions uh, last week. So if you guys were one of the um, Aquarius is that did sign up for my monthly uh, subscription I thank you for being patient for working with me through that hurdle but we are now in a better place and for those Aquarius that have not been able to uh, join yet uh, please do so it's ten dollars a month and you'll be able to get pretty amazing things so some of the dates that I want you guys to have in mind Aquarius is September 1st um, I will be launching new material on September 1st then we have September 7th which is a really cool day but I need you to stay tuned for that one and I also need you to stay tuned for September 29th those are some pretty cool days in September so really cool things are happening um, I have really good vibes for September we are now entering the fall season we're on Virgo season so we're on earth season it's just pretty cool things nonetheless um, I'm gonna do your reading and um, if of, of course if you have any questions you can always reach out to me okay all right let's move forward So at the bottom of the deck here, for your focal point, you have the Seven of Wands, Aquarius. Then you have the Nine of Wands as your theme. Your challenge is the Six of Swords, and your action is the Six of Wands. Whoa. And your outcome is the Three of Pentacles. Wow. So Aquarius, you have some serious um, fire sign energies. So I'm talking Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Okay, so for your overall, you have the seven of wands. So, I mean, there's a lot of um, animosity uh, that you have with a fire sign. And it's just created chaos. Like, you're in a place of chaos with a fire sign. Things are just not... Um, it's just not a... It's just not a good thing. For you guys, I think you're going to have to take some time off from that. But let's see what the rest of the reading says. So for your theme, you do have the Nine of Wands, which means that things are just going to continue to get more intense with this situation that you guys have. It's almost like it's going nowhere, but, but it's going very fast into turmoil into more animosity it's almost like just adding fuel to the fire kind of deal and the reason why is because i feel like this is a relationship uh reading because one of you guys have tried to leave the relationship and the other one is not um one of you guys is just reluctant to reluctant to move forward and whether that's you aquarius or it's um your partner it's creating so much friction. It's almost like one of you guys are in a relationship, but the other one isn't. Um, it's just, it's just so awkward. Like, and you both keep looking at each other, like, so you don't understand that you're in a relationship. And then the other one is like, so you don't understand that we're not a relationship. What, like, it's just, you guys are literally like. Alpha and Omega, like you guys, and there's no circling back. It's linear, and one is here, and the other one is here. That's just what it is. So, for I'm going to say though, Aquarius, especially because the, your action card is the Six of Wands, I'm going to say that you guys are the ones that are in denial. And the Six of Wands, 
is asking you to revert back and just make the decision and understanding that you're not. It's, it's just simply not. It's not. You know, you also have the Three of Pentacles here in reverse, meaning there's no manifestation. You know, there's no more work. There's nothing else that you can do to help this other person change their mind. It's a done deal, Aquarius. And, you know, it sucks. It's a really sucky situation, but it's just, it's a, it's done, Aquarius. And, you know, I, I honestly, I genuinely feel bad because I, I see how much you want this and you've put in so much work, but you have the Three of Pentacles in reverse. There's, see... Uh, three of Pentacles, right side up. You see the uh, the generosity. You see the love. You see the the bonding. You see the coming together, the working together. That's gone. It's long gone. Not happening. You understand what I mean? So, um, yeah. It's just it's that's just what it is. So. But just to go back on the Six of Wands, for your Six of Wands, I need you to just accept and make the decision to move forward. Um, that there's no other option really for you. It, it's just what it is, Aquarius. You, you're going to have to just move forward. That's the decision. That's your action for the week. Okay? And even if it's going to be tough, I get it. I get it. Um, but that's... That's what is being advised for you to do, okay? Yeah, it's a love thing. Yeah, it's interesting. A couple of people have gotten this. Um, okay, so for your first clarifier, you have the green chakra. The green chakra is your heart chakra, and it's asking you, to remember love you know Aquarius there comes a point that even if at some point in, in this relationship there was love it is totally normal and there are many circumstances and situations where love is no longer present so ask yourself Aquarius is this true love is this really 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 love or is it that I'm accustomed to it is it my ego that's not letting go is it that um i don't know maybe you and i want to use this lightly i don't want nobody to get offended but maybe like this is someone that you to maintain your lifestyle what is it that you're holding on to right um redefine love and you know what as in them i'm gonna ask you while you're at it can you please um reconsider what self-love is because you clearly love this person more than you love yourself right now. Okay? Now, um, I'm going to move forward to your throat chakra. And it's asking you for the truth. Because I think that once you go through your journey of what is love, you're going to be able to speak to yourself and at least see the truth here. And that's going to help you somewhat make your decision. And Aquarius, listen, even if things don't look like everything, like anything is going your way or in your favor, or maybe you look like a complete ass. And yes, I, I said complete ass. And I apologize for the French, but seriously, if you feel like it's just that bad, it's okay, Aquarius. And I know it's easier said than done, but you're going to surpass. Your time will come. Okay? Lastly, again, your throat chakra. Asking you to listen. Um, listen to your intuition. What you're going to do here, what I'm asking you to do with your love, is going to then bring you to your truth, and then it's going to bring you to your core, where that's where you're going to listen to, and that's when you're going to wrap up in tap into your intuition and I need you to listen to your intuition part of me always wants to tell you that you knew that this was gonna happen right you knew this was gonna happen and I think that's why you put so much work into it because you felt that by putting so much work into it it wasn't gonna this wasn't gonna be the outcome and you know so many a times actually Aquarius that is true you can manifest things but there's also 
times that, you know, God's timing, you nobody can mess with it. Okay? So there's going to be a lot of enlightening here, enlightenment here. Such things as, you know what? If you were able to put so much work into something that turned out to be nothing, imagine what you can do when you actually get someone that is willing to give you everything. Wow. I feel like I had to say that to you, Aquarius. Um, all right, Aquarius, well, I thank you for your time for this reading. I, If you have any questions on anything I said before I started this reading, please feel free to restart this video and get the information from the beginning of the video. And, of course, if you guys want to have a private reading, just feel free to contact me and we can schedule that right away. Okay, Aquarius, I hope you guys have... Just stay strong for me this week, okay, Aquarius? Do that for me. September 1st, other things are coming. So let, let's, let's just get through this week, all right, Aquarius? Thanks, guys.